Hey guys, it's Saturday. I'm here training with my friends. Um, I'm in CrossFit Polaris training with Christy and then Chandler Smith is here as well. It's kind of our Saturday crew. We've had a lot of fun training together. Uh, just giving us the, the extra push and just having friends to work out with makes such a big difference. Uh, we just did Nasty Girls, I'm not sure if it's the original Nasty Girls or a regionals version of Nasty Girls, but it was 50 pistols, 7 ring muscle ups, and then 10 hang power cleans at 115, 175 I think for the guys, and it was 3 rounds of that. So it was actually pretty quick, really fun, uh, mostly just pistol workout, which is really good practice for me because my long legs were slow at those, so it was fun. Now we are going into something called prison rules. It's I've been doing it the last four weeks now. It is barbell cycling practice, um, just capacity building with the barbell. So today we are doing, starting with power snatches at 75 pounds for females, three power snatches every 15 seconds for four minutes straight. So that's 48 power snatches in the three minutes. Once you hit the four minutes, we rest for a full minute. Uh, we'll change the weight and then we'll switch to clean and jerks and it'll be the same thing. I think I'm going up to 85, no 95 pounds for the clean and jerks. So it'll be three clean and jerks for every 15 seconds for again, four minutes. Um, that gets really, really tough. And then we'll rest a minute, keep the weight the same and we're gonna do the same thing with thrusters. So three thrusters every 15 seconds for four minutes. So um, the last four minutes of thrusters is going to be very mental. Um, possibly that we might not make it. We could go to failure, which that's the point, really push it. Um, really dig in when it gets very mental just holding on you can always do another thruster so um, if you don't make it within the 15 seconds then you're out whether you go down to two reps or you just quit the workout so it will be fun challenging you guys are gonna get to see us suffer a little bit well we're gonna do some barbell cycling I'm practicing my barbell cycling with probably two of the best in the sport right now so what more can you ask for to get better uh, barbell cycling for me is typically I like it's a challenge. I like to do singles. And I sometimes think the lighter weight is actually harder than the heavy weight because you do have to hold on to it and it burns and it drives your lungs and you get the lactic buildup. So this is gonna be super short time frames and we're gonna have to move quickly. I like really long time frames and I like moving smooth and consistently. So it's gonna push me outside of my comfort zone, but I'm excited to give it a go with two of the best in the sport. What percentage is this? Percentage of my power snatch? Gosh. Um, Shoot, I don't even know. It's probably around my 50%, where I think for Amanda it's probably like her 25 or 30%. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. 75 pounds. Oh. Not very heavy. The only thing is, is What's that up divided by 200? I athlete. do that regularly. Not um, an athlete. Light, that's what it is. Light and painful. Well, we all made it through prison rules, which was awesome. Um, it was actually easier than last week. Chandler did it with me last week, minus the thrusters. We didn't do thrusters. Um, I think it's amazing how your body like adapts within a week of doing something. You know what to expect. You know how it's gonna feel. So we got through the snatches with pretty smoothly. Clean and jerks were still tough, but not as painful as last week. So once I got to the thruster and did the first set of three, I was like, okay, I can make this. Like, it's just 48 thrusters. I can make it through focus on breathing. The cycle rate of the thruster was a lot faster than the clean and jerk, so we probably had like 10 seconds rest each time, which really helped. Uh, yeah, so all three of us made it. It was really fun. Uh, we have one more piece to do. Uh, row, handstand push-up. No, I think it's row climb, handstand push-up, row. Three rounds, first set's legless, and the second set is regular row climbs, and then we're doing 
deficit kidney hand sand push-ups on both of them with like a pretty decent deficit so this will be fun last piece of the day and then we'll be done yay Hey guys, we just finished training for the day. It was a really fun Saturday, and now we're gonna answer some of the questions that you submitted to Chrissy and I on Instagram. So just rapid fire questions for all who are gonna answer, and hopefully you learn something about us. All right, question one. What's your favorite vacation spot? This could be somewhere you've been or somewhere you want to go. Who's answering first? Anywhere with a beach for me. Mine is St. Kitts, because that's where we went on our honeymoon. Philadelphia, also <laughs> known as Philadelphia. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out CrossFit 205. <laughs> what is your favorite food? Let's go one cheat meal, one regular healthy food. Tacos, I don't eat healthy food. <laughs> I was gonna say anything Mexican, that can be healthy or not, but if we're going unhealthy, then I add the margarita and the chips and guac. Definitely tacos. <laughs> I love <laughs> tacos. <laughs> or um, I'm addicted to bagels right now. I don't know what my deal is. Me too, every day. If you could only have one ice cream for the flavor for the rest of your life, what would it be? Cookies and cream. Reese's peanut butter cup. Summer edition cotton candy blizzard from Dairy Queen. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you've tried that. <laughs> what is your favorite movement within CrossFit? Ring muscle. Burpees. Power clean. What's your favorite benchmark workout in CrossFit? Grace or heavy grace. Ooh, heavy grace. Definitely not mine. Mine's not going to involve a barbell. Uh, Cindy, 20 minute AMRAP. Pull ups, push ups, and air squats. 12.1, uh, seven minutes of burpees. Oh. <laughs> if you take one, what's your favorite pre workout? Uh, I take X Endurance's Focus. It's really good and has a bunch of caffeine in it. I don't take pre workout, I drink coffee. I would say no go, so I don't get in trouble. She said ex <laughs> What did you study in undergrad? Well, I went to the University of Louisville and I studied business and I came out with an accounting degree. I went to Cleveland State and I studied health sciences, like pre-physical therapy, because I went to grad school for physical therapy. United States Military Academy, I was a double major in poli-sci and Spanish. What sports did you guys play growing up? Um, I did gymnastics when I was young, and then in high school, volleyball, swimming, and track, and then I swam in college. You go next, Chandler. Uh, football, wrestling, track, and technically basketball, although they never let me on the court, so I didn't really play. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I swam, played soccer, ran, uh, gymnastics, whatever other sport my mom would let me play. <laughs> What's your favorite movie? Ooh. Stand by me. Remember the Titans. How to lose a guy in 10 days. <laughs> What's the last book that you read? The Undisputed Truth uh, biography, Mike Tyson biography. Nice. You already can't remember the name of it. Um, High, performance. High Performance Habits. There you go. I read Mindset, um, the new psychology of a mindset. It's about <laughs> the growth and fixed mindset. I can never remember the title, but it was a mindset book and you guys should read it by Carol S. Dweck. If you guys could choose the first event of the CrossFit Games this year, what would it be? 12.1, seven minutes of purpose. <laughs> Max power clean. <laughs> 30 ring muscle ups per time. Wow, you guys are way opposite. To the side of the <laughs> We're so predictable. <laughs> so. What is one interesting fact about yourselves? I don't have anything interesting. Wow. <laughs> we like to exercise. <laughs> my, my car's name is Valerie after uh, the Amy Winehouse, or it's actually a Mark Ronson song uh, called Valerie, 2010. Rest in peace, Amy. Um, everyone thinks my husband looks like Stifler. <laughs> oh, everyone thinks my husband looks like John Cena. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Very active. I, I can't unsee it now. <laughs> we'll, we'll have them pop on the camera for you guys to see. Come on. <laughs> My expectations are a little high right now. Every 
excites you? Uh, well, really, we just wanted to answer a couple of your guys' questions, um, show you that training can be fun, especially when we're about to compete with each other. It's competing with, not we are against each other, but at the same time, we want to lift each other up and support each other and push each other to be the best versions of ourselves that we can be. And it's great to find friends to help you balance that, and that is something that, if you can do, find people to push you, and that will make you better. Yes. If, it's, if training is fun, you will train harder, for sure. So, we hope you enjoyed this. Have a great day. See you guys. Peace.